Bannerman. <laughs> Pretty lame, right? Yeah, I just heard. And can we please not use the B word? What? Bioterror? Yeah. You know, that's just a slur invented by the DUP to make people scared of Connerys, man. Look, whatever you want to call him, let's just track him down and find out what he can tell us about Augustine. And drain his powers. Okay, fine. And drain his powers. I'm telling you, it's gonna work. All right. They just found a body at Fifth and Briar. Go check it out. But promise me, you'll be inconspicuous. Yeah. Listen, Delson, it, it's gonna be police officers at this crime scene, okay? Not D. I'm here to support you, but killing cops. I got it. I got it. I'll put my phasers on stun. Okay, I did it your way. I passed your boys in blue. Thank you. Although, what's the use of having smoke powers if you... Well, found the victim. Ah, Definitely the work of the conduit. Brother. It's very... showy. Okay, I need you to take a couple pictures of the crime scene and send them to me. Anything that might give us a lead. There's your wounds. What kind of power did this? Fire blast or lasers? Ooh, what about flesh-eating death gaze? <laughs> I wouldn't mind absorbing a little flesh-eating death gaze, right? Delson, even if the guy who did this is a prime conduit, we still don't know if this power transfer thing's even gonna work. Well, you know what? If it does, my first victim is gonna be the guy who came up with the name Bannerman. Bro, you really need to let that go. Okay, sending you the picture, but I think he blinked. Uh, Reg, I'm hearing sirens, man. Yeah, let me check real quick. The DUP's just cordoned off the area. I've warned the Seattle PD to stay away. It has to be the conduit. I'll check it out. No, it's get the conduit! Jeez, and good luck with that.
Well, this conduit sure got a certain style. Kind of nouveau sick. Okay, just need... Let me guess, face and wounds. If it's not too much trouble. All right, there you go. Stand by for wounds. No need. Got a hit on the face. This guy's a drug dealer. Rap sheet's a mile long. Look around for his stash. I give us a clue why the sniper chose him. Our sniper going after him. Be careful. Real original. Wait, 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 wait. Don't impale me. I come in peace. It's okay. It's okay. I'm one of you. I mean, one of us. Would you slow down? I'm not gonna hurt you. God, especially if you don't slow down. No, he ran fast, like really, really fast. Conduit fast, man. Screw flesh eating death gaze. I don't want that. Don't be greedy. Funny thing, man. I just. All right, I'm here. Any idea what I should be looking for? Just anything well, that might help with your sniper. Well, one thing this place tells us is that our sniper is a sniperette. Wait, what? You should see this, Reg. It's like the girliest sniper's nest you've ever seen. What does that even mean? I, I don't know. It's just girled up. Girl stuff. Like the name Brent burned into the wall in girly handwriting. And it is definitely the best smelling assassin's den you could ever be in. Okay. Look, just send me photos of anything you think might help. I wonder who Brent is. I can't help you there. Okay, I can see how you might think those are women's shoes. Yeah, they're like size negative. Seriously? A serial killer who reached Jane Eyre? Oh, totally. Jane Eyre is like the female catcher in the rye. Okay, those definitely very likely belong to a woman. Like you know. So, anything else interesting? Relax, I'm looking. I guess this counts as interesting. That's interesting, all right. You know, it's a long shot, but maybe if I run this through the database, cross-referencing the name Brent, good lucky. You know, if I had smoke and lasers, I could, like, put on light shows in our living room. Oh, that'd be putting your powers to good use. Hey, Reg, I was, uh, I was just thinking about the bras. Well, stop, okay? Seriously, just stop. Okay, I'm thinking, when I get to Augustine, it's gonna be like, whoom, smoke, and then once I got on the ropes, it's like, zap, zap, I'll whip out the laser show. Well, it's good to have a plan. Hey, I got a hit on the photo. His name's Brent Walker. One arrest two years ago for minor drug possession. Get this. Found dead two months later in an alley. Cause of death? A single puncture wound of unknown origin through the chest. I need the address now. Yeah, our girls definitely got a thing against drug dealers. <laughs> sure seems like it. It's weird though, man. If she's just killing drug dealers, then why do the news reports make it sound like she's picking off random victims like it could be anybody? Yeah. Well, you'd think the DUP would want people to know the killings weren't random. That if you're not a drug dealer, you're not in danger. That sure bring the panic level down. So you're saying what? The DUP is trying to scare people? Their job is to control the panic. All right, I'm at the alley, but there's a bunch of heavily armed dudes here. Looks like a drug deal's going down. I hate to 
go all cop on you, but it is the duty of every citizen to step up when they witness a crime in progress. Delson, I heard shots. D did you kill them? Hey, I was trying to do my duty as a citizen, man, but they were trying to do their duty as criminals. French. You should see this, man. Speedy gone crazy is a tagger. Pretty damn good one, too. Yeah, well, don't forget yeah, she's a murderer. Girl makes a mean right? vortex. Pretty damn good one, too. You really shouldn't leave lit candles unattended. She sets a lovely altar. It's actually kind of touching. Yeah, well, there's good touching and bad touching. And now we come to the highlight of the tour. Okay, that is full bore crazy. Okay, so the girl stops off for takeout, comes here to sit with Neon Brent to tell him all about her day while she chowders down. You know, Olaf's has a location on Alaskan Way. He's supposed to have one of the biggest neon signs in the city. Hey, if I had neon powers and a chowder Jones, that's where I'd hang. I'm on my way. Sign our petition to get drugs off the streets? Unless we stop this poison, more of our youth will turn out like Fetch Walker. Fetch Walker? Her body was corrupted by drugs, and the drugs turned her into a... Wow, I'm impressed with your impulse control. Um, uh, maybe you should wait up by the neon sign, yeah? Might be less conspicuous that way. Besides, she'll probably head there to recharge. Yeah, plus there's probably less people I want to kick the crap out of up there. That too. Okay, just need a place to hide. Okay, this is good. Surveillance, hobo style. Oh man, that smells good. Why didn't I take some cash off those dealers? Money, why do you hate me? Be my friend, Money. Come to me. Let's bond. It's okay! God! Ah, not this again! Just like last time, Delson, concentrate! Oh, no, 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 no. You're not getting away. I got this now. Walls? <laughs> you have got to be kidding me.
what I came to do. You've got to calm down, all right? Just relax. You're not taking Just me relax. back! Juice for her. Bad news? I'm not a nice person. Huh? Maybe stop trying to kill me and we can let the beer signs live to see another day. I'm not weak anymore. Not that was anymore. awesome. Wait, are there really robots? Just want some of your powers. That's all. Leave me alone! Come on, Charles. I know you're in there. Surprise me. This. I am not going back! No! Stop it! As a little girl, I never thought it'd be me. That I'd be one of them. My powers were a surprise. My parents turned me in. They knew what the government would do to people like me, and they did it anyway. I didn't know what to do, but my brother Brent just grabbed our coats, and we ran. Those were hard days on the street. Moving from city to city, no comfort anywhere. Until we met some dealers, and man, they hooked us up. The drugs. The drugs were heaven. But then we always wanted more. And the withdrawal, agony. Always looking for a fix. And when you lose your stash, when you think someone stole it from you, the drugs, the dealers, they make you do things they...
government picked me up easy enough after that. But it wasn't a regular jail. They trained me to shoot, taught me how to kill. So on the day of the crash, I escaped with all those skills. Everything I needed to set things right. Brent, I promise, every dealer I find, I'm gonna burn your name in their chest. No one else is gonna suffer like we did. <clears throat> no, brother. Nobody else. <laughs> hey, Delson. Delson, you all right, brother? What happened? Oh, she did good. You did good, buddy. Come on, get up. Get up. Oh, Whoa. Hey, you did good. I know just where to put filth like this. Somewhere where Augustine won't find her, and she won't be hurting anybody else. Hey, no, 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 no. She's just killing drug dealers, man. Killing? Nelson, murdering drug dealers. What do you think I'm doing with the DUP? What you have to is save the Akomish back home. She stays free. No. Dude, no way. Look, just because you have the same affliction, not gift, affliction, doesn't mean that we're gonna pick up every little piece of trash we find. Look, I'm never going to abandon you, all right? Not ever. This one goes in a cage. Hey! It should be my responsibility. Yeah, because responsibility is not exactly something you excel at. I got this. Fine. I'm here for the tribe of the Holland bioterrorists. I'm a conduit. He's cool. He's normally cool. He's just not today. Yeah. Let's talk. All right, Reg, sorry. I... Oh, look who it is. What, is the meeting of the Conduit Club finally over? I just wanted to talk to her, okay? To see if maybe she could help us out. Oh, you are not doing the pouting Reggie thing, are you? You know I hate that. You know someone like that shouldn't be free to roam the streets. Uh, are you forgetting who else is someone like that? I'm not the same. You're different. Yes, the... I know. I'm your brother. And your brother is asking for your help Go and trying to stay alive. If you won't do it for me, then do it for the tribe. Fine. What do you need? Thank you. I need to see what else this new power can do, and you are my go-to guy when it comes to finding the core relays. There. I sent it. For the tribe and you. Thank you. Bye, pouting Reggie. Hey, Fetch, you know those blowing boxes the dupes put up all over town? Yeah, I've seen them. I think they can track us with them. Well, I think I figured out a way to use them to, like, tap into more powers for me. I was gonna try it out on the new neon power you gave me. Gave you? And I thought maybe you'd like to tag along, you know, maybe talk me through the new stuff. I already bagged my dealer limit today, so why the hell not? And there's my sweet girl. Screw you. Okay, there's supposed to be one of those things at uh, second and main. Yeah, I've seen it before. Meet you there. Hey, Fetch, it's over here. Yeah, I'm cool. Kind of which trackers and me don't get along. Well, wait till you see. You're on your own, D.
Hey, uh, you guys seen a girl kind of short, purple hair? Oh, just winged it. You're welcome. Hey, I heard gun. No, I think they were just on patrol. Well, I found another one. I left you signs to find it. See it? It's a neon marker. Uh, yeah, got it. Just follow those. Hey, Fetch. Just stumbled across a bit of your handiwork. Think maybe you want to dial it down a notch? Gotta feed the fury, dude. Or maybe you don't feed the fury. It'll starve to death and you become a people person. Like me. Or, or maybe you can bite me. Take that, you poison peddling garbage! It's what you deserve! Hey, Smokes, you want in on this? Yeah, yeah, you still need help? Don't need it, but I'll take it. Taught him a lesson and left him to think things over. I didn't kill him. Hey, we have powers. They don't. Means we have to be the better people. Cut him a little slack now and then. Think about it. Yeah, yeah, whatever. You're a man. There it is. Go ahead and get your convulsion on. You first. Trail. 
Fetch, I uh, see you started taking these dealers down alive. Can't help but think I had something to do with that. Yeah, all you egomaniacs think you're the reason for everything that happens in the world. No, I don't think I'm the reason for everything. I mean, just your highly visible change in behavior, that's all. You know, anytime you want to actually hang around for one of these things... I've been thinking about what you said before. About the drug dealers on the street. Oh, yeah? The way I see it, going after those ass gum dealers is just small time. But going up the food chain a little, finding the supplier, that'll change things. Well, I'd be glad to tag along next trip you make up the food chain. Just don't think I've ever actually changed anything before. Sure. It'll be a date with a death hole. I'll give you a call if anything comes up. <laughs> 